once upon a time, not too long ago, there lived in a beautiful big valley four special animals. Fred, the donkey, the cat, Gwendolyn, Tortellini, the rooster, and Buster, the dog. peacefully together with men and other animals. Although the four did not know each other, they had a common love, music. was born a hunting dog, but he couldn't care less about hunting. Instead, he enjoyed daydreaming and playing with his friends. But when he was sold to the mighty Baron Henderson, the good times were definitely over. Come on, old doggy, the fox is waiting. Is this the new one? Oh, yeah, and the Baron paid through the nose for him. He's supposed to be a real killer. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, <laughs> hey, look at this. Guaranteed Canadian blood out. As effective as ten regular hounds. Loves music. <laughs> oh, oh, great. He plays the violin and a fox just drops dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 hey, get this. It says, don't ever pull his tail. <laughs> How about that? Oh, boy. Looks like we got Mr. Touchy Tail here. Hey, hey, maybe he's loaded in fires from the butt. I'll kill myself. <laughs> Love the world, it'll love you back. I say, 
I say, what in blue blazes is going on here? Hmm. He'll never make a hunting dog. It's quite. Looks like the Baron got himself a real flop. <laughs> <laughs> like to make you a fair offer. Mm-hmm. Here's our catalog. We stuffed all these animals personally and gave them eternal life, as you can see, and eternal smiles. Yes, uh, uh, go get the amazing hound. Yeah. Oh. Remember, don't pull his tail. A rare specimen. <laughs> a pretty many of what, what? <laughs> Oh, it's a deal. Oh, this is great. We never put our hands on a dog like that before. Just what we need for our collection. <coughs> Come on, boy. You'll make a great mummy. Yes, after life everlasting. <laughs> oh. Come back here, Yogi! Great! Oh, teach you to listen to me! Oh, no, don't pull his tail! Well, though, well, I love animals. Good puppy, please, stay where you are. Gentle dog has his limits. Fred the donkey carried loads of flour sacks day in and day out for years. And since his voice wasn't half bad, he sang while slaving away. But when he got older and slower, he preferred singing to working, something the new Miller did not accept. Hey, be quiet! <laughs> we enter this world with a miserable cry. It's a drag from day one. Tell the mama we die. A seat in the front room Got a room with a view <laughs> I took a good hard look around at me And suddenly I knew Even the angels cry in heaven Tears are washing us away No umbrella keeps you dry. You know that life is one cold and freezing place. Don't ever expect mercy from the human race. 
place I once tried. I've been near and I've been far. There's always someone stronger and much better looking than you are. Nobody wants me. Nobody cares about me. You enter this world with a miserable cry. Start looking for a replacement. Uh, Let's call the butcher. We might still make a couple of bucks on his rattling bones. <laughs> yes, Miller speaking. I want to sell an old donkey and I need a replacement. We can send you our newest power tool, a donkey replacement machine. Oh, dear me. How much you look like you're really in trouble. Wonderful. That's not expensive at all. All my life, I've been hauling flower sacks, thousands, day in and day out. And now this? No, no, it's a good price. I don't even want to think about it. Maybe I can help. Pull yourself together, all right? You're one to talk, but what do you know? You can just buzz off when things get rough. Okay, send it over right away. Jobs isn't tough enough. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> now that's what I call efficiency. I'm doomed. Units, enemy sighting. First wing, prepare to attack. All units, commence the attack. Peter? No, my name is Buster. Apart from flying, what else can you do? Usually I walk and I sing. No way. I'm a singer too. They call me the Melody Barker. They call me Fred. Where are you going? I'm off to see the world and make my fortune. I got fired from my job as a hunting dog. And on top of that, they were going to get me stuffed. You can talk. I lost everything. All I have left is my music. Come with me. There's always something better than death. But where to? Hmm. I got it. Let's spin the bone. The thick end besides. Paris, here we come. I'm going to Paris. I'm going to Paris. I'm going to Paris. Gwendolyn the cat had a wonderful life with her beloved Aunt Wanda. But after the old lady had passed away, her future looked pretty rough. I herewith announce the opening of the deceased's last will. My entire estate and everything else I own goes to my nephew and his child. My legal heirs must take care of my cat, Gwendolyn, in her familiar surroundings because she is the guardian of my treasure. Should they fail to do so, everything I own goes to the Humane Society instead, mm -hmm. and my lawyer, Dr. Seven Brains, shall be trustee on Gwendolyn's behalf. And what about the jewels? Yes, Aunt Wanda owned the famous Prama Puthra jewels. Twin stones, one red, one white, worth millions. Why aren't they mentioned? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hmm. Sorry, I know nothing about it. I must be toddling off. Good evening. Uh -huh. Jewels, maybe they don't even exist. Maybe she knows. I'd get her to talk right now if she could, I swear. Yeah. What are we supposed to do with the mongrel anyway? Lounges around all day while we run ourselves ragged waiting on her. Who does she think she is anyway? The Queen of Sheba? Oh, uh, don't forget the will. Remember, Aunt Wanda wanted us to take care of that cat. Yes, but only as long as she's alive. She might have a little... Just a few drops. There. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Come, kitty, kitty. There's a nice kitty. Oh, the animal refuses to eat. That monster knows exactly what's going on. We've got to think of something else. <laughs> yeah. The Mix Max Man! 
You cold, ma'am? Where's this monster? She's in the cellar. Whoa! I want to catch the pussy cat too. I can't see her anywhere. <laughs> I got him! You know, Fred, if you want to be successful in the entertainment business, you're going to have to learn quite a bit. Here's your first lesson. Okay, just relax. Let your face hang loose. Yeah, that's it. Now, just take your mouth and kind of pull the edges up towards your ears. Like this? Yeah, yeah, you've got it. Now, let your bottom lip slide off of your teeth. Like this? Uh, yeah. Take five, buddy. Give your face a rest. Key. You left today when I won't go goodbye. Big girls never cry. Now I find myself out on a limb Without a friend, the future looks grim Hoping this river of sadness is running dry Hey girls, never cry such a beautiful song before. Oh, no. It's a cat. Why so sad, gorgeous? Oh, Aunt Wanda passed away. Sorry to hear about that. We're headed for Paris. Come with us. We'd make a great trio. Oh, I'd love to go to Paris. Not with a cat. No way. Well, I guess a trio with a cat is better than a duo with a donkey. The last of the four, Tortellini, the proud rooster, 
was fed up with wasting his genius in the hen house. With a God-given voice, he was destined for greater things. But one day, he found himself in real trouble with Big Mother Bertha. Your big time flop, useless macho has been. Ah, get out of here and take that too. <laughs> So much for that. <laughs> Stupid chicks. Made them happy for years and now zero gratitude. Outrageous. Now where the this to Hmm. Don't they know who I am? Incredible. See if I care. Off to where the grass is greener. Hi, Jordy. <laughs> Hi, girls. What's up? Isn't he cute? <laughs> and the hair. I, for one, have possibilities you can only dream of. Adventures, freedom, ah, life. Come, come! May I introduce myself? I am Tortellini, the great Tortellini. <sighs> All the chicks were hot for me. And if it hadn't been for an affair with a lovesick duck, I tell you... Oh, well, never mind. Oh, please. What a show-off. And what about you? Where are you going? We're going to Paris. To make music. Oh, you're talking to the right person. I can sing better than Michael Jackson and Elvis put together. Hey, wait up! I'm coming too! Hey, you little genius through and through. Come along with me with your cock a doodle doo. Hey, we stand and strong. Together we'll work out whatever is wrong And in hell we'll build a wall We'll form a chain of love A stronger than it all <laughs> Gotta get out of this forest But how? No end in sight Nothing but trees for miles and miles <laughs> Hello? Hello? Can anybody hear me? What's all that racket about in my forest? Who are you? Uh, we're musicians, and we're headed for Paris. Paris? <laughs> you want to go to Paris? But Paris is in the opposite direction, a thousand miles from here. Huh? Oh, no. I can't believe it. The nearest city is Bremen. But I'm warning you, Bremen is not what it used to be. You don't want to die young, do you? Doom and death if you go. Doom. And dead. Don't go. For me, even Bremen is fine. We're artists. And good artists will succeed anyway. Yeah, 
I'm sure we'll find something better than death there. That city is under a spell, and only a monster can break it. A monster with eight eyes and fourteen legs. Beg your pardon? I think she's a little crazy. All we want to do is sing. We'd really appreciate it if you could show us the way out of this forest to Pat. I mean, to Brennan, ma'am. Oh, I warned you. But if you must go, I'll show you the way. <laughs> they'd taken the Owl's warning more seriously. Instead, they kept on heading for the city, hoping to find their fortune. They had no idea that Dr. Greed, the notorious tyrant in his mix max gang, dominated the city, destroying anyone who stood in his way. Because he had strange powers, and he got them, rumor had it, from the devil himself. Owl had forgotten to mention that singing and laughter were strictly forbidden in the city. Not a very promising start for a bunch of aspiring musicians. What can go wrong together strong? Ooh. I woke up last night with a chilling cold sweat. Some things of the past I can't seem to forget Looked around in the dark, saw my brothers right there I'm no longer alone, I'm no more on my own This is both life and friendship we share I found a shoulder to lean on, our friends always there what can go wrong? What can go Together wrong? Together we're strong. Oh. One for all, all for one. That's how it's done. Woo what could say more? We're the feelings for. No I thought singing was for kids. Wow! Dig this music. Gotta play it. I've been on the run. There was trouble, I was there. I have been treated and counted down for it. Rock bottom one day. Hey, why don't you play my music? Get lost. You know so There is nothing and no one we fear. Nothing. We're an invincible posse. Look out! I cannot believe this! Stop! Ah, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, they got dumb nerves. They're in the center of town, too. We should have them arrested. Let me take care of them. No, wait. Uh, what for? Doesn't sound bad at all, does it? Uh, no. No, not at all. Not at all. They are very, uh, talented. 
I've got an idea. Eh, uh, but singing is strictly prohibited. Of course, you idiot. But if it's for the syndicate, you get it? Oh, what do you want me to get? <sighs> Don't ask stupid questions. Ma'am, gentlemen, my compliments. You're exceptionally talented. Exceptionally? Your voices are worth millions. Hey, where are you from, anyway? You guys got names or what? Tortellini. The great Tortellini. I am the leader of the group. These are my musicians. Delighted. Platini, vice president of Mixmax Trust. Where's our card? Uh, uh, oh. Thank you. Well, I think I could get you the proper contract through our advertising department, for starters. <laughs> well paid, of course. You're talking to the right people. We sing classics and rock. Oh, we'll make you really big. Makes Max Trust. I've heard this name. Now, how about coming to our office tomorrow morning? It's that big building around the corner. And we'll, uh, Ired out the details. Why, yes, Dr. Greed. Of course, certainly. I think we found just what we need for our purpose. And they really know how to sing? Yes, and pretty good, too. And you did say a dog-eared dog, a cat, and a rooster? Yes. Singing animals. Sensational. Perfect for us. Nobody would dare accuse us of being against animals again. They'll, uh, be in the office tomorrow. Well, just make sure everything goes as Here's the contract. <clears throat> now, the most important rule, gentlemen, and lady, you can't work for anyone other than Mix Max Trust. If you should do so, you'll have to pay back everything. Huh? But if you stick to the contract, uh, you'll have it made. Travel, luxury, world fame. And what about committed head to tail? Well, your artist, dedicated from your head to your tail, <laughs> aren't you? And our song selection. I mean, we'd like to pick our own. The trust decides that. Uh, I mean, uh, we gotta look out for you, don't we? Be my guest. I'll sing anything. After all, it's my career, isn't it? Sure, your career. All you ever think about is yourself. Well, okay. If you don't want to. Oh, of course we want to. What's it all done? Something I wanted to tell me. Okay, let's get to work. <clears throat> now, I expect to see you in the studio tomorrow morning at 7 on the dot. When we're rich and famous, what are you going to do with all of that money? That's easy. I'll get myself an opera house and produce an opera. No chickens allowed.
as a state and make it into an animal shelter. How about you, Fred? What are you going to do with your money? Me? Nothing. I'm happy with what I've got. I'll make you an offer, Fred. Put your money to my opera house, and you'll get free tickets for the rest of your life. Ooh, I hate operas. I know what I want. I want us to stay together as long as we live, because together we can do anything. You'll be appearing on TV every morning, making everybody happy. <laughs> what more do you want? presents the Fearless Four, the best tasting sausages in the world. Mix Max Trust has moved into the entertainment business in a big way. Nothing can stop the Fearless Four. That's supposed to be a song. Why not? It's the interpretation that counts. Oh, it's just too much. I can't stand it anymore. Yup, yup. What a lovely sausage. What do you want? We don't want to sing that song anymore. We're all getting ulcers. Fred's been having nightmares. Yeah, about giant sausages trying to do me in. Uh, and I got migraine headaches. Get yourself some aspirin. You must keep singing our jingle even if it kills you. Your own compositions. <laughs> You've got to be kidding. We'll see who has the last laugh. You'll hear from my lawyer. And what exactly does Mix Max stand for? Who's Mix? And who's Max? Why don't you admit we're talking about sausages here? What have you got to get sausages? You do as you're told, get it? A contract is a contract! Yes, but when does it run out? Uh, paragraph four, the contract is unlimited. Look, look, I'm a good-hearted person, generally speaking. But if you refuse to come around, I can get Pretty nasty. <laughs> There's nothing we can do. They're all our voices. Not just our voices, our souls, too. Buster, you're right. I... I am? Yes. They're using us to deliver their message. But we have a message of our own. Listen, 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 you guys. I can't 
can't deal with this. You know what they're doing? They're picking their own material. I hate since it's wearing thin. <laughs> Mix, max, don't trust the mix, Nobody leaves this room! Mix, max, mix, max, it's time to fight them back! Mix, max, down with the mix, max! <laughs> the four were brought into the prison on Dr. Greed's compound to keep them under control. This is preposterous! Ah, protest! Ah. Uh. Where's Fred? <laughs> Revenge, my friend. I'll show those crooks. I'm going to. <laughs> when we get out of here, we should have listened to the owl. Hey. Are you ready for my music now? Come on, this way. It's easy, just follow me. <laughs> Very funny. And how do we get through there? Uh, let me see. We're doomed. <laughs> It's gonna go wrong. I know it. I just know it. We're right behind you, okay? Me? You want me to go first? Exactly, Fred. You. Whoa! 
The Big Smack song. Oh, well, in my compositions. And now our next step. The marvelous, completely automatic, fast, fast food sausage machine. the model of the most sophisticated computer-driven sausage machine ever invented. It will produce 12,000 sausages an hour. Let me explain how it works. Right up here is where it goes in, and down here is where it comes out again. <laughs> We're having a test run next week. Only the knives are missing. <laughs> It's for you, my friend. Uh, uh hello? <laughs> Any problems? They're gone. I, I mean, who's gone? <laughs> Speak up, will you? They're gone. The, the musicians, it was, you know, uh, for... You messed up for the third time, that's it. No, no, please, I don't. Triple O six. Huh? Our entire plan is at stake. Is that perfectly clear, gentlemen? Sorry, boss. <laughs> You guys, 
How's this? If you play my music, I'll show you the way out of this place. That's blackmail. Okay, okay. Follow me. Uh, I can make it work. My father was an engineer. <laughs> it's the only way out. Through the machine? You'll be our scout. You go first. Why me? Didn't I hear you say you're our leader? Don't worry. Remember, the knives are missing. Fortunately, I keep my father's number for just such an emergency. getting worried about our star. I hope they didn't get him. There! Look! Over there! Oh!
Chicks could see that. Hold your beak. What did I say? You ought to be ashamed of yourself, Tortellini. Could somebody tell me what's going on around here? I promised those animals we'd get them out of there. Yes, you did. I did too. Well, all right. But can anybody tell me how? I've got an idea. First step is to show up again. You mean go back to the lion's den? This time, we'll turn the tables. They can't do the show without us. We'll go back and tell them we've changed our minds. But I'm scared. Fear may be contagious, but so is courage, my friends. They're back and they're very sorry. We got them under control again, I assure you. I certainly hope so, for your sake. We'll be celebrating my election party with a big concert in three days. We need those four and their song more than ever. Everything must work as planned. You know how important this is? Why, uh, certainly. My presidency is at stake. I'm aware of that, sir. <laughs> and after that? After that, they have to disappear for good. I'll hold you responsible. <laughs> Understood, sir. Everything's under control. Stuff together. This big sneak. He, he's got a machine gun. There's no turning back now. That's right. An artist never shies away from danger. <gasps> hey guys, it's me. I see you got a little snake trouble, huh? But don't worry, I'll handle it. <laughs>
trust me. The bad guys never give up that easily. We have to find a way to scare the daylights out of them. Us? Scare them? I've got an idea. Our slogan about togetherness. All for one and one for all. Or all as one. No, got a funny feeling, you guys. Wait, I can hear something. There it is again. Something's headed this way. I can't make out what it is. A very strange creature. A an alien, probably. It's got eight eyes. And at least 14 legs. Uh, maybe oh, more. Like a hundred. A giant centipede. A giant monster with four <laughs> Oh, no! Those responsible will pay! We'll punish everybody! We'll show the people who's the boss! What in the world is that? all those animals.
about the two of us I hear the voices in my sleep We are wrong for each other Every word against you cut so deep I look at you when stars and moon are rising And I know for sure that you are the one This love has only just begun Don't you worry about a thing Baby, close your eyes I'll take care of you Till the end of time That's what I'll do What the years to come may bring Is a guessing game Nothing ever stays the same I'll be there so don't you worry about me There's so much more than meets the eye Never go by what you see Any shape, breed or color It's the size of heart that counts to me I must have known you in another lifetime Cause when I'm with you it's like I'm from home I will be alone Don't you worry about a thing Baby, close your eyes I'll take care